In this video, we'll demonstrate how to remove the follow button on your Facebook profile. But before we dive in, I invite you to hit that like button if you're excited to learn this and share your thoughts in the comments below. Your feedback helps us create better content for you. Removing the follow button on a Facebook profile can enhance privacy by preventing people who aren't friends from seeing your public posts and activity, offering better control over your online presence. It can also reduce unwanted interactions with strangers or acquaintances. It's pretty quick and easy, so let's jump right in. Now, let's just open up Facebook, and I will first show you what that follow button looks like, and then walk you through all of the steps to remove that follow button. Now I'm going to tap on the menu icon at the bottom right here. If you are using an Android device, the menu button might be situated at the top right. Tap on your profile picture or your name at the top left of the screen. Right next to Edit Profile, there are three dots. I'm going to tap on those three dots and then I'm going to tap on View As. You can see here I have a follow button right under my name and if I don't want any random person following my account anymore, I can remove that follow button. However, it's kind of hidden in the settings of Facebook and I'll walk you through how to find those. So, let's tap the X at the top left and then go back and go back again. We'll want to scroll down until we find Settings and Privacy. Now we'll open up that toggle and tap on Settings here. Once you're in Settings again, you will scroll down until under Audience and Visibility, you'll find Followers and Public Content. So, we will tap into that. You can see that everything is currently set to public or everyone, and we want to limit those to just friends, friends of friends, or only me. So I will choose friends here. So everything that was public or set to everyone is now friends or friends of friends. Now, let's go back and check our profile again, and you'll notice that the follow button is now removed. So I'll scroll back up to the top and click on my profile. Then, I will click on the three dots next to Edit Profile, and then I will go to View As. You can see now that the Follow button has been removed, and nobody will be able to go on there and just be able to follow you if they visit your Facebook profile. If you found this video helpful, please take a moment to like, comment, and subscribe with notifications. Your likes and comments inspire us to create more content like this, and subscribing ensures you won't miss our future tutorials. You can find more tutorials and resources at our website, MediaMagnetGuide.com. Stay tuned for more exciting tutorials and tips coming your way.